Christmas, and welcome back to Chrono Trigger. Today, I'm visiting Ozzy's Fort. Come on in, this is the great Ozzy's place. What the? Whoa! You, you're the great Magus! You're doing well, Ozzy. The nerve, deserting your fellow mystics to serve these humans. You're a traitor, you're not our king! Why did you desert us? Why did you desert us? You pesky low-down good-for-nothings. Ooh, I'll have you begging for mercy. Flee! You sent for me? Well, if it isn't Sir Magus, who'd you bribe to get in here? Traitors like you deserve a beating. Oh, great Ozzy, stand back and let me take care of these Cretans. I'm counting on you, Flea. Get ready for a slapping good time. Get it? Alright, how does Flea respond to Dark Bomb? Oh, wow. Alright. Oh wow, that was short. Marl learns life too. Nice, now I can swap her out. Oh, just you wait. We'll teach you a lesson. Alright, so... Swapping out Marl's armor so that Luca can wear the prism dress. And let's see here. Alright, looks like it's Magus, Luca, and Robo that are the only ones that still need more tax. Oh, I love I love the traps in Ozzy's fort. Howdy! You're nothing but common thieves. Anyone who tries to steal my treasure is looking for a very cruel death. Ignoring the fact that Ozzy's arm and the uh, crank are not in line. And away we go! Oz Ozzy's in a pickle! Out of here! So yeah, I love the implication that Ozzy wasn't the one who set up the traps in Magus's lair because when he sets up the traps in here, he combines all the things about his traps in ways that don't make sense. You still haven't given up? Well, how about a good thrashing? Slash! You rang? Slash, don't let me down. At first, I really didn't want to slice and dice here, but now it sounds kind of fun. Ready? Alright, Dark Bomb. Let's see here. Ow, 31 damage. Yay, level up. Fire tackle. Double V-bomb? Ouch! Come on, sweethearts. And if I just... Like, he didn't put that in such a place that I need to get it. Don't you want the treasure box? Probably fill with goodies. Found the treasure! Oz, Ozzy's stumped. Out of here. And now I'll take the treasure. Yep, not worth taking the hit for. 
Heh heh, not so fast, friends. I'm gonna make it that easy for you. Ozzy Pants. Flea Vest. Slasher 2. These unique items make us invincible. Okay, so the big question right now is who can I hit without uh, triggering a counter? Delta Force, uh oh. Alright. Robo, you're on healing duty until I can figure out who it's safe to attack. Now, hypothetically, I could have Ayla in the party and steal these items that these characters are so proud of. But I probably wouldn't be using them, like especially the Slasher 2 and the Aussie Pants. The Slasher 2 is a sword for Chrono, which is weaker than the, uh, uh, than the sword that Chrono already has. Hmm, bad impulse. So I guess the weakest counter comes from Slash. Great Aussie Super Slash Flea Plus. Let's see here. Oh, right, I learned something recently about the golems. The twin golems, which I was so worried about. They're vulnerable to sleep from Luca's hypno wave. Okay. It, it feels like the way this game is built, spells like fi single target spells like fire were meant to be useful into the late game. Which is really cool. Yeah, next on Magus's next turn, I'm gonna restore some of his MP because oh, never mind. The improved action economy is definitely worth the MP. Oh, Robo learns shock. What in that? A dash ring and a sight cap. Nice. Okay, yeah. Ooh, 60 MP. Hmm. 
Magus, you lied when you said you wanted to create a world of evil. You used me! Oh, how dreadful. Say, can you hear that? It's the sound of the Reaper. I can't lose. What will become of my mystics? I must win! Gotcha! For all of Ozzy's incompetence throughout the fort. Adios, amigos! This was... Hilariously competent of him. Which reminds me. I forgot something. I believe it's in here. No? Hmm. Huh, how strange. Unless there's more to the fort, there's something that I missed and I can't remember where it was. It's one of those things that would be obvious from the point of view of the characters, but is well hidden from us. Never! You will never defeat me! Hey, it's a kitty. Hey, kitty. N no, not that switch! Okay, so that is the end of that quest. <laughs> what was he trying to accomplish? Well then. Oh. Here we are. Gloom Cape, Gloom Helm, Doomsicle, and a Magic Tab. I feel like I haven't gotten any Speed Tabs in quite some time. Gloom Cape. Gloom Helmet. Oh! Which frees up a... Uh, Vigil cap for someone else. How nice. Oh, that reminds me. There was a thing that I forgot to do. A thing that I don't know how you're supposed to discover it, but I discovered once accidentally just because I decided to... At one point I decided, yeah, you know, I want to go explore this old place. And I just happen to have Frog in the lead. After having completed his quest. Let's see here. I don't know why I ever decided to come back here on my own when when I was a kid, but like I just randomly decided to show up here one day. Ow. All right. Oh, 
Wow. Even the incredibly... Even with my characters at as high a level they are now, that Ogun is still incredibly resistant to our damage. Alright, so... Wait, what am I doing? I approached this all wrong. Oh. Oh well. Problem solved. Not as elegantly as I would have liked, but it's been solved. Oh, and here we are. I await thee, Freelancer. It started glowing in Frog's hand. You got the gold rock. A changed frog, art I? Like, as far as I know, there's nothing that hints that you should even do this. I just happened to do it once. I was actually trying to avoid getting hit by those rocks. And yet, here we are. Anyway. The rest of this episode is just going to be me getting back to uh, the map and saving. Okay, so I'm going to attack this one. Because it's, you know, able to be killed in one hit already. Gonna burn this one. And then I can take it out. And there we go. I like how the solution they had for giving Frog a legendary sword partway through the game. Keep having it be relevant for the time that you get it, but not be an endgame weapon. And then, uh... Making it into an, an endgame weapon because it's still a legendary sword. Alright, join me next time when I, uh... I think I'm going to a factory in the future, actually. Yeah. That might be the final quest. Anyway, join me then.